Hey guys, it's Maisie and welcome to today's video. I am going to show you some of the things that I have purchased for Christmas. So basically it's like a Christmas haul and I'm actually very excited to show you because I've got some real good stuff down here and plus they're all bargains. All the things from here are either from Poundland, B&M or Wilco. So they're affordable, they're cheap and they're good quality. Also, do you guys love my little tree? This is the first video that on my channel, oh my god, this is the first video on my channel where I've got my little Christmas tree in the background of my video. So, welcome the tree, I think we should name him. I don't know what to name the tree. Leave a comment below of what we should name this tree as I feel like because he's going to be like an end of every video we film over this month, we should have a little name for him. So, I say, let's get in to the video. I'm going to start with what I got from Panline because I mean, I only got one thing because like extra. This little wreath. How cute is this wreath? Basically, it's tinsel and it's got a little red bow on the top. And oh my god, it's the cutest thing ever. Um, me and my mum brought this because we are doing a little DIY home Christmas decor video going up sometime this month. I do have the date, but I'm not releasing that to you because, I mean, that was more the fun. Um, so yeah, that will go up this month. And it is in my 12 days of Christmas. Ah, be excited. Um, so yeah, we've got this cute little wreath to decorate. So that's going to be a great experience. It was like a couple of quid. Decent. Next is Wilco, and basically the majority of stuff I got from Wilco was gift wraps. Like, the stuff to do with that. So I got two packets of these meter, four meter bead chains. And I'm going to use these for, like, videos, for, like, decorating, like, the wreath in my video. Um on presents and basically make them look real cute because it's like who doesn't love a good red bead at Christmas they were both 40p each which is a bargain then I got this cute wrapping paper look how cute that is it's pink white and silver and it's extremely girly it's just so cute and then I got obviously the more aesthetically pleasing for me like the white black and gold one because I mean look how cute they are I mean, who's pres who wouldn't want their present wrapped in something like that? And because I'm, like, extra, I got the gift tags to go with it. So they're the ones with, like, obviously the white, gold, and pink. And then they're the ones with the black, um, white, and gold. I love these ones the most because they've got you rose gold. They're black with rose gold geometric shapes on, like everything I stand for. These gift tags were 85p, and you get 8 in there, so that's a pretty good thing. Um... And then in these packets you get 10 sheets and then a pound each. Actual bargain. And I got this cute little bauble. This was £2 and look how cute it is. Inside it's just got a little van, well a little car with a tree on top on a, like a block of snow. And it's so cute. And um, it just hangs nicely. And the reason I got this was because... One of my favourite Christmas songs is Driving Home for Christmas. So, and the reason why that is one of my favourite Christmas songs is because they have it in Gavin and Stacey. And Gavin and Stacey is like one of my all-time favourite programmes. So, you know, every time I get this out at Christmas now, I'm going to be like, Driving Home for Christmas. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Loving the bauble. It's love a good bauble, if you couldn't tell. Love a good bauble. And an elf, apparently. Um, next, we got these. You might be thinking, what the hell are they? Yes, they are Santa's pants. If you're wondering, they are Santa's pants. Um, I mean, I can't really open it, but like, they open obviously like that. It's like, they stand like that on the side. And these were four pound. And what you do, you hang them on like two hooks like that. So like, obviously like, they open nice like that. And then you stuff them with like little presents. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put this in the background of some of my videos because I think that will look extremely cute. So that was all I got from Wilco. Next we're on to B&M, which I got probably too much from. So first of all, I got some snow. 
because I am very extra. Um, my family are very extra when it goes to Christmas. Like, it's the time of the year where basically we go crazy and wild. And snow is um, one of the best things that we do at Christmas. So I'm going to, like, um, you know, decorate everything with this snow literally like we like to make a little snow scene in the living room because we have like you know them like um like ornaments that like buildings like a car carousel wheel or is it like a ferris wheel or like a shop or something which like makes little music sounds and like has a light inside it's really cute and like christmasy then um we like to put snow underneath them to make like a snow scene it's so cute so this is um approximately eight, 50 centimeters by 80 centimeters apparently and it's a glitter snow blanket look it has you can't really see it okay it's got like specks of glitter in but you can't see it um and this was 1.99 so that's an actual bargain because the last few years snow has been expensive but i mean that's not like the best quality snow we do have like better quality snow which is like more nice but it's very hard to get it's so hard to get snow nowadays without it being like faulty is an actual nightmare next we've got these cute little ornaments little ball balls they're called 18 nordic decorated ball balls i don't know what nordic means but we'll just roll with it um so yeah there's two random red, red ones which i don't understand and then there's two random green ones it's like they just didn't like them colors for the rest of the packet um there's silver blue and gold as well and they all have like pieces of snow on top which is so cute and these were 2.99 and I'm going to hang these on one of the trees downstairs because who doesn't need baubles? Let's be honest, who doesn't need baubles? This is like one of my favourite items to go on the tree downstairs, like on the on the big one. And it's these, oh, they're beautiful, these um, glitter butterflies. And there's three of them in the packet and these were 2 49 oh, This They're beautiful. Like, if this doesn't look, like, identify Christmas to you, I don't know what does. Um... They're like a decent sized butterfly. They look like really good quality. And they've got like clips to clip them on with, which is also good. Because I can't I can't deal with like them ornaments which have like um like the string attached, but it's not like string, it's like a bit of elastic. I don't under never understand. Never will, never have, never want to to be honest. Then we got some of these geezers. These are like one of my favourite things at Christmas, basically. They're stickers which you put on your wall. Well, which you put on like your windows and doors and that lot to make them look festive. And there's 12 in here. See, look, window and wall stickers. I mean, dodgy to put them on the wall, I would say, but I mean. See, they said self adhesive and removable, which is good. These were 250 and there's 12 in here. So, oh, look, there's pictures on the back of what you can do with them. Look, put them on the wall, put them on the window. Beautiful, nice, special added touch. Next, we've got some cool lights. There's a hundred in here. Well, you know, like a little, just a wee bit, slight bit. There's a hundred in here, and they're called Cool White Ultra Bright LED Chaser Lights. Oh my god, that rhymes. I love that. Um, so, yeah, they're like a cool tone, like these ones. They're not like warm, because I mean, who could deal with warm? These are going to go in the tree in the kitchen because, I mean, beautifulness. Um, these are 5 99 That is really good for lights. I mean, you go to webs or something, they charge you like £20. Rip off. Tell you all, I wanted some light to put in my kitchen. Ridiculous. This next item is going to make me seem like such a child, but I don't care. Because it's super cute. Look at it, how cute is that? This was one pound and it's a little tray. And it has Santa and Rudolph and it says a treat for Santa. So you put the mince pie there and you put his glass of milk there and then the Rudolph, Rudolph, the Rudolph and the reindeer's carrot there. And it says, dear Santa, here are some treats for you to help you on your journey tonight. P.S. Thank you for the presents, kiss kiss. Which is so cute. But I'm obviously not gonna leave it out for Santa. I'm gonna leave it out for myself. So basically, what I'm going to do, my plan, I'm going to put my cookie on it, I'm going to put my hot chocolate on it, and I'm going to eat it off this and be like, yes, I'm still a child deep in my heart, when I'm like not. I mean, it's just cute, and it'll look great on Snapchat. 
and it will make me feel like a great person. So I brought it. <laughs> Next is this really, really cute little stand. Well, it's a hangy one, but I mean, no. So my dad's gonna like put a little stand on the back for me so I can stand it up because I can't be done to knock nails into walls. And it says, Alf Surveillance is watching. Make sure you stay on the nice list. And oh, when I saw this, I couldn't like not walk by it because it's just so cute. This was 199 and it was beautiful. Even, it's a chalkboard and it comes with its own little eraser and chalk thing. And basically I'm gonna write subscribe on it so that you can see it in my videos. I'm like, oh my God, it matches my outfit at the top. <gasps> so cute, that long lost twins. Class. Last but not least is the thing that I've been obsessed with this Christmas. And it is the Nutcracker. Yes, you heard it here first, folks. I'm obsessed with the Nutcracker this year. Basically, every year, I somehow find... Oh, I nearly whacked my face with Jim. Oh, Jim, be careful, darling. Um, I find something to be obsessed with at Christmas. And this year, it's the Nutcracker. I don't know... I'm going to place him down elegantly. I don't know why, but we've never, ever, ever had a Nutcracker. And mostly, it's because I've been terrified of the people. Um, I've never really liked... The I've never really liked, like, um, what do you call it, show, play, musical, whatever it is, of the Nutcracker, like, this one, like, never been a fan, um, always used to scare me, so I never really bought a Nutcracker, but this year, I was like, do you know what, I want one, so then I got one, and Jim is going to look really cute, I mean, look how cute Jim is, I mean, he's got his, he's got his, like, rifle or whatever it's called next to him and everything, he's having a whale of a time, Jim is. This was 5 99 so I think that's a really good price because honestly, I've been looking at Nutcrackers. Oh, they are expensive. It's actually crazy how expensive people want you, like, like how much money people want you to pay. It's ridiculous. Um, so yeah, that's all for today's video. I hope you've enjoyed what I've um, shown you. Also, before I leave you, I want to show you these cute little elf slippers I got last year because these are literally what I'm living in right now. Um, yeah, you put them on, you look like Buddy the Elf, and they jangle everywhere and basically make the dog, um, chase you. So they're a great idea to have at Christmas, it's a great fun and games. They're beautiful, and Primark, I love you dearly. Thanks for Primark last year, you've you done me great. Um, so yeah, I wanted to mention that because I love them shoes. <laughs> All my social media on screen if you haven't already. Comment down below what you want me to call this tree because we need a name for it. We really need a name for it. If it's going to be in every video, we need a name. Yeah, name them down below in the comments. If you're new, subscribe to me as, you know, you have come just in time to see my Christmas videos, which we are all very excited for on this channel. Um, if you are already subscribed, thank you for coming back. I love you loads. Uh, make sure you hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button so whenever I upload a video, it goes straight to your device. That's all for me, and I'll see you guys with another video.